Gymnosperms are a group of non-flowering plants that have been around for hundreds of millions of years. They might not sound familiar, but I bet you've seen one before. Evergreen trees, pine trees, spruce trees, and fir trees are all gymnosperms. The word gymnosperm comes from two Greek words that mean naked seed. This is because gymnosperms make seeds that are not covered up or protected in a fruit like an apple or a tomato. Instead, gymnosperm seeds are usually found in cones. The big tough scales on the outside of the cone help to protect the seed inside. Once the seeds are ready, the scales open up and the seeds can be carried away by the wind to grow into a new tree somewhere else. One of the most famous gymnosperms is the giant sequoia, which is one of the largest and oldest trees in the world. Some giant sequoias reach heights of over 100 meters and have been growing for thousands of years. Not all gymnosperms are tall trees though. Junipers are gymnosperms that can grow as shrubs or small trees. They have needle-like leaves and produce small, berry-like cones. Bristle cones are shrub-like gymnosperms with distinctive, twisted branches and needle-like leaves. What makes them truly remarkable is their incredible longevity. Some bristlecone pine trees are among the oldest living organisms on Earth, with some known to have lived for over 5,000 years. Gymnosperms play important roles in the ecosystem in which they live. Tall pine trees create habitats for animals by providing shelter with their branches, leaves, and trunks. They contribute to the nutrient cycle by enriching the soil when they drop their needles or leaves, helping other plants grow and providing food for animals. Their roots hold the soil together protecting it from erosion and maintaining the health of the ecosystem. Gymnosperms also provide a source of food for animals through the seeds found in their cones. Don't forget to subscribe!